Having one player from your basketball team going on to play college athletics is great. Two, outstanding. But six, that's unheard of. And it's just what happened here in Ottumwa. I think it's really special. Um, we've had a bond since we were so little, and I knew that we always would each go individually somewhere else. Avery and Tara Gott will be teammates next year, but Gott won't just be playing basketball. She'll also be throwing for Graceland's track and field team, where she'll take lessons learned from Coach Kevin Patterson. He taught me how to be very determined and never give up, and he believed in us the whole way through between wins and losses. Ashley Salgado was one of the best point guards in the state and is going to Marshalltown. She led Iowa in assists and, like a true point guard, she said having all these girls pursue their athletic career was a team effort. We've always like worked hard and to get our make our goals, meet our goals and just always push ourselves. So to have all of us go, we just all helped each other individually get better and obviously make it to the next level. It's different with just having your friends and stuff, but being on a team for so long and just growing up throughout the years keeps us together and extremely close. If you had to pick an MVP of the team, it would have to be Kelsey Nickerson. Nickerson leaves Ottumwa as the school's all-time leading scorer and a first-team all-conference selection as a senior. To her, it came down to one thing. Uh, definitely work ethic. Um, always put the time in the gym that, to make yourself better, and that's what we did as a team. But it's not just basketball that these girls excel in. Paige Schreiner will be going on to play softball at Indiana State. Her experience on the basketball team still prepares her for her college career. Whenever you're down, whenever you're up, you got to trust your teammates because they're there for you 100% of the time. You know, this being my first year, you don't know until you see them, but it didn't take long. You know, a few weeks into the summer, I knew they all had potential to, to do something beyond this, and, and uh, I was glad when it all came to be. Atomo supporters have to be proud of what their team accomplished this year. Most importantly, these girls have left a legacy for others to follow. I'm Johnny Mangano, KTVO Sports.